Peter Waboshi is back and he says he's going to reclaim his mandate as he arrives in his hometown in Oshinini, North local government area of Delta State. The Court of Appeal in Lagos had sentenced Senator Waboshi on July 1st, 2022 to seven years over a money laundry charge filed by the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission. After being incarcerated for a year and six months, he has been set free, hence the home of his hometown. Look, I am not afraid of a political battle. I am not afraid of a legal battle. I am not afraid of a spiritual battle. What is it? It's not a contest. Yes. If you win, why will it take you to go and put me in incarceration for one year and six days because you want to run election? Waboshi also says anybody responsible for his incarceration will pay as he urges his supporters to be patient. My mandate is somebody is holding, in brief, brief, holding it in brief. I'm going to take it from him. They think that taking me out of circulation will make them politically relevant. That is, that, that's, that's a waste of time. I've been in politics over 45 years. And I know that they're only wasting their time. So, I'm going to reclaim my mandate. If not, anybody who is involved in my incarceration will pay for it. Either he pays for it or his family will pay for it. Anybody who has there, whether you're a judge, whether you're a, 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 anything you are, and you have any hand in my incarceration because I know I committed no offense, the person will pay for it. You watch and see what will happen. The All Progressive Congress members say they just concluded the Delta State governorship and senatorial elections held were heavily rigged, and the People's Democratic Party would have to defend itself before the election tribunal. I don't think my, in the, my party did not do the Cuba election by the facts I have before me. The facts I have before me, APC did not lead the Cuba election in Delta State. And we are going to prove it in the tribunal. Just like as I'm going to prove that the election of the Senate in Delta North was rigged. The state party chairman, Omeni Soboti, says the former governor of the state's games will soon come to an end. There is an end for every man's wickedness. There is an end for every man's wickedness. Okowa's wickedness has come to an end. In the days ahead, we are going to confront him. We are going to pursue him. To, we are going to hold him accountable for all the rubbish he did for the eight years he was governor. As the court nullifies his conviction of fraud, Huaboshi says he is fully prepared to reclaim his mandate. Yes. I saw one mad boy was saying that Peter Mobo was in prison and he went to tribunal. Am I still in prison? No! Is the tribunal not on? Yeah. The tribunal is on. Yeah. I want anybody. So I have come now, I will be in the tribunal. Yeah. And I'm going to win in the tribunal. Yeah. Jemima Boloko, Arise News, Delta.